Give me random acts of kindness that will restore your faith in humanity. I lost faith in humanity. I don't believe there's any more kindness in the world. Let us see. Do you know how to save the world? Selflessly help three more people. Sooner or later, the chain of kindness will touch everyone. Wow. Well, you ponder that. Chat, when's the last time you had a random act of kindness, bro? Hmm? When's the last time, mother? You selfish sons of Huh? Mother moment we're gonna show you the random acts of kindness that have already started the domino effect your first good deed could be subscribing and clicking that notification you know what you're right i should like and subscribe all right let's watch saving lives is every police officer's duty but today these cops have an equally important job to make these kids day unforgettable <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I know this is supposed to be acts of kindness, but I just pictured like I throw a snowball at a cop and he's like, motherfucker, get on the ground. And he pulls his weapon. <laughs> I start getting my ass beat by the dude with the riot shield. Oh my God. As a child. This puppy was the only thing found alive after a fire. So oh rescuers no. Had to do the impossible. Bring him back to life. Dude, everybody likes firefighters. <gasps> Funky. Oh. Bill Connor decided to make a 3,220 kilometer healing journey to honor his daughter who had drowned. But his ultimate goal was even greater. Wait, Here what? What was his? <laughs> I can't watch this video, bro. <laughs> Oh, hold on. Uh, Kenji, I didn't hear. I did not hear that right. I just, what, Kenji, you're annoying. What I heard was completely different. I'm pretty sure. Let me rewatch. Hold on. Journey to honor his daughter who had drowned, but his ultimate goal was even greater to hear the beating of her donated heart inside another person. I'm not laughing at this. Um, no, wait, wait, wait. So you guys don't cancel me. Wait, have you guys ever watched Shameless, bro? Frank, if you watch Shameless, you know what I'm talking about. Frank gets donated a uh, like a what was it a liver? He gets a liver, and then the dad invites everybody over that has the organs of their dead son. And he was like super. You know what I'm talking about, bro? Please, Kenji, motherfucker, you're sick. No, it's in the show. It's literally a show on Netflix, bro. You gotta believe. Whatever. Because of his disability, this guy will never lead a normal life, but his dream was to ride in a Lamborghini, and blogger Andy Popescu was able to make that dream come true. <laughs> Just a few steps before the finish line, an exhausted athlete loses control of his body, which his opponents quickly take advantage of. All except one. <laughs> a visit from Neymar himself was the greatest thing that ever happened to this seriously ill boy. He asked his idol for just one thing to do his dance when he scores his next goal. Neymar. Did it. Oh my god, bro. <laughs> when you get that good dick. <laughs> oh. Except one. <laughs> I'll take a bitch down. A blah eye, girl. <laughs> Hop in that Uber. She walking down the stairs like this. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <clears throat> oh my god! A visit from Neymar himself was the greatest thing to. I remember, yo, I seen this on TikTok. This was really cool, and I, I seen another one with um uh Messi. Messi kept the same uh like fucking necklace or not necklace, like a little band for like someone's mother, mother or some shit. It was really cool. What happened to this seriously ill boy? He asked his idol for just one thing, to do his dance when he scores his next goal. And Neymar did it. Hey, hey, that's so cool, dude. A mom couldn't stop her little baby from throwing a tantrum. Don't post this video at this point, Kenji. YouTube's gonna go nuts. <laughs> what I, I didn't do, what did I do? What did I do? <laughs> so the whole restaurant decided to play along with the baby to console him. 
Apparently, it's his favorite game now. An elderly man lost 77 years worth of possessions in a single bombing, <laughs> but rescuers didn't stop clearing the rubble until they found his most priceless <laughs> item. What they get? Oh, the puppy! They saved the puppy! <laughs> I, my humor is fine. <laughs> okay, none of this is fu First of all, none of this is funny. Like, at, listen to me, none of it. Actually, I think I think I have some type of trauma where it's like my, my response is to like laugh. Okay, on, on some something, something's going on with me where it's like, it's like, <laughs> it could just, it could just like pop up. This whole family died, like, and I'm gonna giggle. I don't know why, bro. It's not funny. It's just, I'm sorry. <laughs> You're not seeing the pearly gates. Bitch, I already been new net. Like, what are you talking about? Oh my God. <sighs> okay, I'm sorry. You got dark humor, Kenji. <laughs> I, I think I think it's the emotionless AI that's talking and it's fucking me up, bro. Cause it says like the most like this person lost his leg in a like and it's just mad. You know what I mean? I, I swear it's the voiceover. This boy has to wash cars all day to help earn money for food, leaving him no time to play. But this passenger <laughs> gives him some childhood joy for his work. <laughs> leaving no time to play <laughs> like what this boy has to wash cars all day to help earn money for food leaving him no time to play but <laughs> leaving him no time to play <laughs> Kenzie, I swear, okay, i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry this passenger gives him some childhood joy for his work oh i gave him a truck that's cool oh oh that's so cool at just 15, Coco has already become a hero by saying goodbye to Sarcoma after many rounds of chemotherapy. Look at the welcome home parade that her friends arranged in her honor. <laughs> Gamer Dr. Lupo was in the middle of a 24-hour charity stream when he was given a check for $1 million from Twitch. Whoa. Amazing. The amount raised for a children's cancer fund instantly. <laughs> and then that motherfucker went to YouTube. <laughs> that motherfucker went straight to YouTube. Exceeded its goal of $2 million. <laughs> oh, man. In a matter of months, an incurable disease made Tony Gibson forget everyone and everything. No. But his own wife. But the love with which she sings his favorite song causes Tony to remember for a second. <gasps> That's crazy. For That's this fan, sad, every bro. Every match is special because he gets to help his deaf and blind friend enjoy the game like everyone else. Turn him around. This elderly man uses the last of his strength to bring water to someone who can never repay him. Kenji, shut up. I'm trying to be- Motherfucker! Am I buggy here? Am I the- Okay, whatever. Kenji, he's blind. I know, that's why I'm saying the guy should turn him. He's fucking helping his hand turn him around so he's slapping to the mother- Whatever, dude. Okay, fuck you guys. At this point, whatever. Because of her disease, it's difficult for this little He's girl blind. to He's blind. I know! I'm not saying for him to turn around. I'm saying for the guy that's guiding his hands, motherfucker. Not the blind person. This motherfucker that's looking for him to turn him around so he can clap towards the... You know what? Fuck it. No, fuck it. Sure. I hope, I hope one day you can... Never mind. That was going... That's, that's a little too far. I'm sorry. Because of her disease, it's difficult for this little girl to live a normal life. Aww. Her classmates are doing everything they can to make sure she feels included in playtime. If these kids are the future, I think we're gonna be all right. Yeah, right. In a few fucking years ago, but hey, did you see Becky, that stupid bitch? She's fucking Jason. I can't fucking believe her. Every day, a street cleaner watched car owners struggle with the reason. Let's put gum in her hair and spread rumors that she's a whole realities of winter. So on this particularly snowy morning, he decided <laughs> to make their day. W. This employee gets paid to stand at the cash register, but he doesn't hesitate to abandon his post at the sight of a hungry man in need. W. 
A passenger vehicle stalled out in the middle of a flooded street, but a truck driver with an incredibly kind heart came to the rescue. What if he wasn't even trying to rescue her? He's like, get the fuck out the way, bitch! <laughs> Just trying to run her over. <laughs> When a police officer sees this little boy driving a toy car, he decides to play along with him in the cutest way ever. Stop resisting! Kicks the <laughs> kicks the fucking car over. Oh, stop resisting, bitch! Put your hands behind him. <laughs> I think I actually, bro. This video is not for me. He's out of And just so you know, cops can even turn into wizards when a little girl needs them to. Aww. As long as there are still people on Earth who will let a stray dog drink straight from their hands, humanity definitely has a chance. Aww. How heartless does a person have to be to throw a bag of newborn kittens into a pond to drown? <laughs> and what are the rescuers standing around for? One thing's for sure. This random passerby the fucking it's not a bro on oh god kenji it's the i swear on my life i know what it is it's the voiceover why does he sound like he's throwing a bag of kittens into a pond like it's not on god it's not me bro it's the fucking voiceover if it was anyone else oh obviously kids in a pond isn't funny obviously that's fucked he sounds yeah he sounds like someone's sitting on his chest or like squeezing his nuts and he can't breathe how heartless does a person have to be to throw a bag of newborn kittens into a pond to drown. And what are the rescuers standing around for one thing's for sure this random passerby is braver than all of them <laughs> braver than all I swear it's the voiceover chat. Please don't think I'm a piece of shit. Pilot noticed a model airplane stuck in a tree, and it reminded him of his own childhood. So he decided to return it to its owner at all costs. Fucking helicopter clips the tree. <laughs> a poor dog was caught between a busy road and a concrete wall. All it could do was keep moving forward and hope for the best until a bus. <laughs> Oh, look, a fucking model helicopter. Let's go save it for the kids. <laughs> oh, man, hey, man, hey, we're going down. Like, bro, can you stop my fault? <laughs> kids, move. <laughs> kids, move. <laughs> oh, it ain't that funny, bro. I'm sorry, dude. <laughs> Just thinking about my fucking imagination, brother. Holy shit. <sighs> <clears throat> This driver gave it a fighting chance. And this stray dog just wanted some affection. <laughs> made it, made it, the trees in the heli. <laughs> Kids, run! <laughs> just fucking explodes. <laughs> oh, fucking yeah. Can't you move on? I'm, so, I'm sorry, bro. <laughs> oh my fucking God. I can't enjoy shit over here, bro. Y'all be on my dick. Oh my God. I can't have no fun over here. Holy Forward shit. For the best until a bus driver gave it a fighting chance. And this stray dog just wanted some affection and that's how he found a loving owner. This guy using his hand to help a sleepy old lady just warms my heart. Instead of pocketing the $1,500 he found, this young man reminds us all what it means to be a person. Be better than me. I'm taking at least a hundred, bitch. Gas money. This worker would have spent an entire day sweeping up leaves with a broom if a helicopter pilot hadn't come along and gotten it done in just a couple of seconds. Now, do you see <laughs> Mayday, mayday! <laughs> bitch with the broom, over. move! <laughs> Over, the driver will lose his job, so he holds onto it for dear life, not knowing what to do, until a bunch of other people come to the rescue. Oh shit. Whoa. This Indian kid is just two years old and has already realized how important it is to share food with those who need it. Here's the true meaning of the phrase to have someone's back. Mm, that's cool. Little Gracie was so afraid of people that she couldn't even eat. But 
Then a veterinarian decided to eat in a cage with her until he had won her trust. And now she's gonna be just fine. Why you say Indian kid? Yeah, I was gonna say the same shit, but Chad gets mad at me when I react. The woman was trapped in her own car, and she most likely wouldn't have gotten out if not for all these people who were prepared to risk their own lives for a stranger. This guy has plenty of muscles, but the one that really counts is his kind heart. Thirsty. Fucking squirrels are When a basketball evil. player decided to give his t-shirt to a young fan, he had no idea how much it would mean to the sick boy. He, he's wording it on purpose in a weird way, bro. I swear to God. I'm not going to say anything because I'm, yo, oh, you're Kenji. But motherfucker. A homeless man named Daniel didn't hesitate to give the last of his money to a stranger who didn't have enough for bread. It turned out to be a well-known blogger named Vi Fakati who immediately rewarded the man for his kindness. That is yours. I, now question. Hmm. No, never mind. Stop it. What? I didn't say anything. <clears throat> no, no. Speak your mind, Kenji. This is your stream. No, I'm. I don't want to no more. Yummy. <laughs> I'm sure this was the big break he had been waiting for in his life. Imagine what would be left of this boat if onlookers had waited for the fire department to arrive. Fortunately, this resourceful boat driver was there to put it out. In oh just a shit! Of seconds. Twenty-two Thank smiles. You. While this officer was keeping everyone on the road safe in the pouring rain, this stranger decided to take care of him. Why is he towering over him like that? Now, watch as this homeless man takes care of the only important being in his life. Yo, you know what's real fucked up, chat? There would be like, um, like I'll see posts like, oh my God, this, um, this dog is here. Like the dog is so hungry with this homeless person, right? Motherfuckers care more about the dog than the homeless person. I'm sorry. I'm not saying like fucking, oh, you shouldn't care about dogs, but motherfucker, should we not care about the fucking starving human being on the floor? And motherfuckers would just like steal the puppy. Probably like the only thing keeping a little motherfucker going. You feel me? Like I, that shit to me, it boggles my mind. Anyways, my fault. I shudder to think what would have happened to the driver of this car if a stranger hadn't rushed to their aid at the very last second and pushed them out of the water with their bare hands. This stray cat decided to have a rest right in the middle of a bike path and only one man cared about its safety. <laughs> This woman nearly had to swim across a flooded road. Thankfully, a gentleman with a yeah. tractor was there to help. Imagine what it's like to get stuck on the edge of a cliff in the middle of a mountain road. Holy. The road turned out to be busy with nothing but good people driving on it. As a mother was being hauled away in an ambulance, all she cared about was that her kids were taken care of. And these firefighters made it their personal mission to make sure that happened. See, firefighters are dope, bro. If I ever get my own dog, I'm going to treat him with the same love as this old man. Believe it or not, even thousands of people can set their own interests aside when someone else needs help. Why they all got vest on? What the fuck is going on? An entire family got trapped in a flood, but they survived thanks to the lightning fast reaction of a dump truck driver passing by. The next time you want to blow your money <gasps> on nonsense, just remember what this man Monkeys! Come on. When this little girl asks people to knock knuckles with her, they all react skeptically. But once they do it, they are delighted. Aww. Hmm. <laughs> A school bus driver had a medical emergency and there was no one to stop the vehicle. Fortunately, there were no passengers on board and police officers were able to use their cars as a break. That's scary. Brakes just give out, dude. Even bitter rivals unite when a player needs immediate medical attention. 
And that's all for today. I'm that's sure all. now I'm you're sorry. already convinced of the power of good deeds, but which one really proved it to you? I'm sure now. I'm not, like, okay, on God, W video, amazing, wholesome people, humanity is saved. Bitch, it's not my fault for me laughing at some of these because the way he says it, okay, it's not my fault. On oh, God, the voice is, I'm, bro, I'm trying to tell you, I'm not an asshole. The voiceover is fucked, okay, chat? I swear to God.